everybody, welcome back to Andrew Ainsworth Golf Academy. Good to have you along with me as always. Excuse me one second, let me just put a little bit more light on so you can maybe see me a little bit better. Hopefully that's a bit better. Right, product review today. Uh, came in yesterday, my new fitting kit, Ping i25 irons. I've uh, been waiting for these for a little while to come in so I can post a review for you folks out there. So i25, let's give you, I know there's already some reviews out there from uh, some of my fellow PGA professionals and very good as always that they are. So Ping I-25, um, first thing I should probably say about this is it is very similar to the I-20. Um, and I'm being completely upfront about this as I always am on reviews. I've got the I-20 here and I've got the I-25 and I've got to be honest when I put the two down I'm struggling to tell you which one's which. I know there are some subtle differences in the design and ping design clubs absolutely brilliantly, and I'm sure we're gonna see some differences in the playing characteristics, but from a cosmetic point of view, very, very similar. I-20 is a fantastic club, um, and I'm sure I-25 is gonna fill its boots. But here's the first question to ask you folks. If you've already got I-20, would you change to I-25? Me, personally, I'd stick with the I-20. Um, if money's no object and you fancy a change, uh, maybe your specs change or you fancy a different shaft, then why not? Hey, but my first impression is quite similar. So just, excuse me while I just go out of shot for a minute, um, just have a, well, see, I can stay in shot and I can read it off the screen, that'd be much easier. This is just talking a little bit about how the, the clubs all compare in their range now. So. Uh, I-25 is a 17-4 stainless steel, it's got a tungsten sole on it, okay, uh, forgiveness moderate as opposed to the G25 which is extreme, um, trajectory is medium, we've got a club head size which is progressive mid-size, so the head sizes are progressive and they do change a little bit, so the shorter iron's a little bit smaller as you get into the bigger irons, the head size gets a little bit bigger. Club design competition, top line medium, um, blah, 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 offset low to medium. So that's kind of how it stacks up. So what Ping is saying about this is this club can be used by varying standards of golfers. Again, honest opinion, if you're struggling with your ball striking and you're maybe improving, I don't want to put a handicap specific on this, but um, if you're looking for a bit more help, I will be going G25, but if you're a decent ball striker, then I25 is certainly a lovely looking club. As I look down on it, it's got this nice thin top edge, I've got the 7 iron in my hands here, quite a compact design. Um, so, let's give it a hit. Let's just get on to GC2. Uh, I've got 7 iron here, I've got it made up with the CFS stiff, which is ping standard shaft. Great shaft, comes in regular and stiff and all sorts of other variations are available. It's a black spot, standard lie, standard grip. Got a couple of Pro V1 golf balls here. GC2's up and running. I've got a dodgy golf swing, so let's give it a hit, see what happens. Not a bad strike for an old duffer. Let's see what we get. Felt great coming off the club face. Enjoyed that. We'll just have a look at the numbers in a second. Actually, I'm gonna have a look at that one now because we might not get another hit like that. We might be here some time. So let's get some numbers. Um, club head speed, 84.4, which is my normal club head speed with a seven iron. Uh, ball path, swing path, pretty good. Club face, half a degree closed. Carry distance, 160. Kind of pleased with that. That's probably my average carry distance of a seven iron is probably one four, one five five, one five six. So one six is pretty good. I did strike that pretty nicely. A little touch of draw on it. Spin rate five thousand eight hundred. Eighteen degree launch. I'm quite a low launch of the ball, so that is quite a low launch angle. Um, felt good. Let's give it another hit. Might not uh, better that one, but we'll we'll have another go. So, again, as I sit it down over the ball, I love the compactness of the look of the head. I like the minimal offset. Um, great looking golf club. Love it. Let's give it another hit. Oh, dear me. I use that one. Did you see that? That was horrendous. Shoot me. So 
Told you I should have stopped after the first one. Just doing, just throwing these in just to show you that I'm human and all this is filmed live. <laughs> Look how far left that's gone. There's no golf club in the world that help me there. Let's try another. Okay. Not bad. A little bit of a push to the right that one, so I'm going to lose a little bit of carry distance. 150. So you can see the variation there in distance. Can't get over that second shot, was it bad? <laughs> I should delete that. I'm going to leave it up there so you guys and girls can laugh at me at my expense. I don't mind, I'm not proud. So when I struck it really well, 160, and that was that was pretty good. Came off the second one, you know, we'll put that one away in the in the golfing, golfing uh, nightmares, shall we say. Second one came off at third one, should I say, came off it a little bit, and we got 150 carry. So I-25, do we like it? Of course we do. I mean, I don't think Ping have ever made a bad golf club in my experience. It's a super golf club. They're a great manufacturer. Obviously, custom fit is what Ping's all about. So for goodness sake, go and find a fitting centre. Go and get fitted for these clubs because, you know, they're going to cost you a lot of your hard-earned dollars, pounds, whatever you're going to be spending them on. And you want to get it right. Um, so, love it. First hit of it today. I'm very impressed. It's a great golf club, it does what it says it does, it's going to help you, decent ball strikers, maybe people aspiring to step up a little bit in terms of what they want to hit and performance, definitely going to work. So, there it is, I-25 from Ping, it's a winner.